Hi Libra, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot on YouTube and MeWe and Buddy Advice on Facebook. This is your reading from the 29th of April to the 5th of May. I'm using the Mythic Tarot deck and this deck is based on uh, mythology, astrology, uh, the Greek gods and um, the Roman uh, culture and history. I will be making a film on each card and I will do the mytho mythologically, mytholo mythology story for each card. How it originated this, this, this deck and uh, how tarot originated and what this deck means. Every deck is different, um, but I think this is an amazing deck and I love the stories. I love mythological stories and um, that's why I'm going to make um, the series. I'll be doing it in English so anybody in Dutch or any other language can follow it in their language and we'll hopefully we'll learn something. Um, I've got the first card for you um, and I've gone off rabbiting again. Sorry if you're new then you can become a member down here it's free or totally free and click on the bell then you'll be notified uh, when I go live or new videos are uploaded and I go live every day and you can come into the chat room and I call the chat room the tea room and I'll give you a card because every day I stream and give every zodiac sign a card or energy for the day. The card is meant as food for thought. Okay, well the first card you've got the ten of wands. Here you can see the man is absolutely totally devastated and tired. He's thinking of what is going to happen next. He's taking time out, he's resting and that's also with the nine of wands but here he's contemplating because the ten is the end of a phase and a new beginning. Perhaps um, the clarification card here is that there is a man, he's honest and he's bare-chested, he's not scared of anything, he's, he's most probably a, um, a strong self uh, He's strong and he's self-assured. I couldn't think of the word, sorry. Um, he's self-assured and he knows what he wants. He, he carries the ring of the masculinity around his neck. That's Mars. But he's actually um, the heart. So he's like uh, uh, the cups, the king of cups in this deck. And I think he's absolutely majestic. He's good looking. He knows what he's want, he's looking at what he's want and he's thinking there, I'm going to go for it, like the fire signs do. The fire signs go into action, also the, the swords, but here the signs, this card depicts it so well, the fire signs, they think, they think out the strategy, uh, strategy logically, um, creatively and with passion. And they go for that new beginning. So it might be that you are meeting a new person. Um, you would think it's a man, but the cards aren't. Uh, they aren't sexist or racist. So if you're a, uh, a man, you might be me meeting a, a woman. Uh, most probably a fire sign or a water sign. Um, perhaps you. The hard time was that somebody has left you and took something away because this is the seven of swords and here you can see somebody is sneaking away. Perhaps you've had a breakup in, in the past, perhaps it was a water sign or a fire sign and since this is the seven of swords it could also have been uh, an air sign and, and that is clarified with the clouds. You most probably had words with them because the swords are people of communication and if something, if they don't like something, they'll tell you the bare truth and that will all, might orchestrate an, a quarrel or a disagreement. But remember, after rain comes sunshine. The sunshine is breaking through here and every cloud has got a silver lining. If this is a new man that you're meeting, um, then um, forget about the past forget about the person that's left you and you know in the vice versa decks or the new vision deck there's a man 
walking away and you see the back of him, not the front. And then that meaning says, you, you, uh, he doesn't care, he doesn't realize that he's left somebody behind hurting. And this is the cause of him leaving sneakily and taking something away, most probably your heart. It hurts, it really hurts, tremendous. You feel devastated, you feel alone, you feel powerless. But don't worry, because there is a new beginning, like I said, forget about the past, let it go, you've uh, experienced it, you know what to do now, you know what to expect, a new beginning. And you're standing in your strength and you're going for it. Because at the uh, end of the week, you've got the eight of wands. You might be going across oceans, you might be hearing news or get news. You will get news through the wands stand for fire and it's usually um, the, the staves that are thrown through the air, but here they're crossing by boat and they're the torches on the boat. But it means news, most probably cyber news, so from a satellite. Could be telephone, email or SMS. In the olden days you had airmail, so that would be airmail as well. So if there is somebody um, that is from the older generation that uses airmail and does still write uh, letters, it could be airmail paper as well. And for this card, we've got a clarification card. Your wish or goal is coming um, true. Like I said, you might be going on holiday. That might be your wish. You might be immigrating to meet that beautiful man of your dreams, of your wishes, and to start a new, fresh life. And you forget about the past. Underneath the deck, we have the Page of Pentacles. So you will be receiving news. Perhaps, like I said, you might be traveling. So you might be traveling for work or getting a new job or getting news that you've got the new job and you will be traveling. And that is your wish. And uh, the Page of uh, Pentacles underneath the deck means um, new, uh, news about finance or news about a job. It is pentacles is something of material and so you can touch it you can it's not spiritual it's something that you can feel and touch um, for duration and long term so perhaps you might be meeting this person and getting this new beginning and you will be immigrating or going on holiday with him and you're forgetting about the past because you've got stability now and like I said in the beginning you've experienced the past so let it go you know uh, what to do and what is coming a new beginning you've learned from it and you'll mature that is your theme card I hope you've liked this reading and take care God bless and be blessed and I hope to see you in the live session take care bye bye Libra